Hi Cancer, this is Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome back and thank you for sharing and liking your video last week. You are one of the highest. You had 91 likes which is brilliant. Thank you very much. I appreciate it and um, that tells me that you do like the readings and especially the transparent tarot and the transparent tarot is the this one and I'm going to show you an other way of using the transparent tarot now it's absolutely awesome to see you coming out of your little shell and I hope you will remain following me and liking the videos so please like and share with family and friends and as usual there are some goodies um, because we I have got a little video um, I made a little video for the computer or laptop and for mobile devices the telephone how to set your settings when you have clicked the bell on all and um, then you have to give permission in your back office uh, of uh, Google or YouTube and also in your settings of your mobile device so have a look then that should help you getting notif notified when I go live there's also a video on the energy of Libra as we are going in to Libra on the 21st, 22nd, 23rd because the planets have shifted so astrologically seen um, we are offic officially entering Libra between the 22nd or the 23rd be, um, depending on where you live it is also the date of autumn so we're going into autumn and in the pagan or the Wiccan uh, calendar it is called Maybon the Fall Equinox the Fall Equinox being of course in our language and our calendar autumn there's also the first episode up and running on the witches we are using the healthy witch and the workplace and spells and it's absolutely been a great joy in starting the new series again this is purely English the Dutch one will come later um, and um, as I have to uh, wait until Wendy is ready to go and obviously uh, she has moved home and she's still busy and what with the children at home with Kovic so uh, it is all touch and go and being patient and uh, it will come so we will have something for the winter months as well the series is put bringing yourself back into your power and into your strength giving yourself certainty and looking after your body inwards and outwards um, and so that you can feel certain and stand in your strength it has even motivated me and Georgina to start uh, setting goals for ourselves and I hope it works uh, it will take a lot of dedication but it's also great fun interacting and afterwards um, somewhere at the end of the English series um, we'll most probably be starting um, around January starting the workshops because it's more work than I realized and I also have my daily routine at home and I have to make uh, the videos for each week and that takes two three days and next week the romance videos will be out as well so keep your eye open for those things that are going to come and there will be in the autumn once Wendy has joined us we'll start doing something and giving free gifts away and those are with compliments of Shiva Red Feather now there's also the review on the transparent tarot and the latest decks that I have um, got okay so let's get started and like I said um, I'm doing it and I'm going to show you a third way of using the transparent tarot with another deck not just the transparent tarot with the transparent tarot but with another deck um, as it says that you can use them for oracles or with oracles or Lenormand or uh, other tarot cards so I'm going to start 
off with uh, uh, reading the uh, this uh, the the transparent arrow, then the next line, and then I will be layering them. So you'll get quite an extensive story. Now the reading is for the 21st to the 27th of September 2020, and we start off with the Seven of Pentacles. Here you can see the seven, and here you can see somebody throwing the seeds in the air and they'll have to land. Now, what you sow, you shall reap. Here, it's funny enough, it came out in the same position, but it came out here, so this is also the Seven of Pentacles. Here she's plucking the harvest, but now you might start sowing, uh, first of all, in the beginning of uh, the day, on Monday the 21st, and uh, you might be plucking the fruit later in the day. But remember, it takes time to grow and to um, blossom before you can harvest. But perhaps it might be something uh, that you're doing. You've, you're setting out seven uh, different things or even more. And like you might be doing tasks and you've made a list for yourself and you're taking and doing the task one by one and you'll be crossing off. When you cross off a task, then you are reaping the harvest. That is as simple as uh, as you, I can explain it. But obviously it can also mean investments for a later date. Like the farmers, the farmers sow seeds, uh, the first crop, then you, they start once they've done that and they're waiting for it to grow and coming to harvest, so um, then they sow an other crop. So they keep on bringing in a return and a stable way of living. Perhaps you have done that. If you haven't got a job, you've been setting out different uh, feelers or seeds uh, for different jobs and you've applied for different jobs and perhaps you might get a return on Monday um, of one of these applications. Then we have the Phoenix and this is judgment. That is number 20. Okay, number 20. Okay, there you go. You've got number 20 and this is the judgment card. And the judgment card means you will be rising from the ashes like the phoenix a new beginning or a second chance then we have the king of pentacles the king of pentacles is looking at the phoenix at this new beginning like i said you've sown the seeds perhaps for a job application or try a job interview and you're getting a second chance, but this is going to bring in big money. Perhaps you might have sown seeds in the past, um, like a hobby. You might have been busy with a hobby, and you've set it out to, um, you, you've let it known. Let's say you've got a YouTube channel or a, a Facebook channel page, and you've been doing that as a hobby, and you've let people know you want to do this professionally. Now the, the the returns, you are seeing the returns, so it's going to become uh, an earning factor and could be a part-time job. Now, um, the King of Pentacles is also known as that he has the meter's touch. That means that everything he touches turns to gold, will turn out positive. We've also got the Knight of cups the knight of cups um, means that you will be getting news this could come from anybody but s especially from a water sign it could be about love it could be about passion like i said it might be a hobby that you are uh, uh, you are turning into um what you may call it into a business you might be getting an offer from somebody, Cancer, as this is your reading. Sorry, I forgot to mention it, I think. Um, so, you are in your element. Perhaps you might be sending, setting out news, like 
it really means that you will be receiving news but I think you are looking towards the future um, if this is you cancer and you are making offers setting out if you want it uh, I'm just hypothetically um, you are uh, a reader or you are creatively busy and showing people uh, how to make things out of nothing for instance on YouTube or Facebook um, and you want to start making doing a workshop then you're offering to the outside world I am setting out this workshop do you want to come and join me boom there you are lovely if so you are um, getting news about your passion perhaps you might even receive news back because he is the news bringer you might be offering something but news will be coming towards you yes you will get new clients or people that are interested in doing the workshop with you or you might get an offer from an other water sign a Scorpio or a Pisces uh, offering you love or passion or care nurturing it could be a beautiful handsome sensitive uh, intuitive person um, as water stands for emotions so this person it, uh, could be also an other spiritual person but definitely a person that listens to his intuition or her intuition and uh, also they might be psychic a very spiritual person wow lovely they are very sensitive and nurturing like I said so they might give you a helping hand to get this off the ground so that you can spread your wings like the Phoenix and rise from the ashes to make this Midas touch come alive now we're going on to the second uh, layer or row and again like I said you've got the seven of pentacles and she's plucking the harvest here and having a glass of wine even the cat is playing so you might have like I said you might be doing a workshop you might be putting it out there and um, you are getting reactions back news back and you see that you're working together in a group Wow then you have the four of the big arcana and that's the Emperor the Emperor represents uh, Aries so you might be meeting an Aries um, it could even be um, that you might be seeking advice on how to set up the business legally um, because it's getting off the ground spontaneously and very quickly and it's bringing in the big bucks okay so you might want to get a license or a patent or anything like that or advertising so you might seek advice from a mature man that you respect or from a father figure or from a professional like a publishers of the newspaper and edit or the head of the editing department to get your business out there and get it known then you have the nine and that's the hermit and the hermit also represents Virgo well we're just leaving Virgo energy and we're going into Libra energy if you would like to know what the Libra energy means for you or could mean for you then have a look at the video you are after you've seeked advice you might be taking time out a break or perhaps taking time out to contemplate or meditate and evaluate what how you're going to carry on and turn this in this project or this job or this something that you're passionate about into gold Wow there is an ending and a new beginning because the nine is an ending and a new beginning the hermit also represents that the the knowledge that he's um, gained on his journey physically and mentally he passes on to third people so this could be a, like a teacher you're passing your knowledge on to the third party 
and with workshops for instance and you'll be making money you might even get a job offer to become a teacher of some kind or something in the healthcare the last card that you have is the six of swords and the six of swords here are usually is depicted with a boat but here it is depicted uh, with a witch flying away with two others on a broomstick but you might even be crossing water you'll be crossing land uh, you might be traveling okay you might be traveling this is the travel card and taking time out so you might take a short break or you might literally go on a holiday or be moving home and you might be crossing different uh, landscapes different countries you might be immigrating some I'm reading for thousands of people but also you're leaving problem uh, at rough waters behind problem times behind like I said is something is ending and it could start at the on Friday and or in the weekend you're moving on to quieter waters a quieter phase of life Wow especially if you've got the material goods you can spend that money to go out and go on holiday or relax or an evening with the Kovic it is usually quite difficult in certain circumstances and we can't travel because there is a second lockdown but perhaps you might be going out uh, with friends and family to celebrate something now we're going to put the seven of Pentacles on the seven of Pentacles and look Things are multiplying, things are, be are coming forth. It's not just seven, now it's fourteen. And this person is reaching out into the trees. So, yes, you are working together. Now there are two people and a cat. So there could be group work uh, around you. Many hands make light work, and so you can bring in the harvest much quicker and carry on to the next project then we have the Phoenix and we lie the Phoenix over the um, Emperor and then we can see that it, it looks like the Emperor is sitting down but now he's rising this could be you like the Emperor is also an advisor an advisor could also be the teacher this could be you you might be rising up you might get promoted and you needed advice on this from somebody that you trusted and that or that you respect a uh, father figure friend that somebody that's older than you or a professional perhaps you sought advice from shall I become a teacher or shall I become an advisor and they have said yes why don't you but do it in this and that da, 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 way so you can spread your wings you can get promotion so there might be a promotion perhaps like I said you've planted the seeds and you wanted a promotion or a different job you are moving out and spreading your wings you've taken the advice of your advisor and they have told you you most probably will have more chance uh, making more money even if you have to move from one business to another business or move from one place to another city from one city to another city or from one town to the city okay so that you were able to spread your wings you took time out to think about it you've contemplated about it and you've evaluated after the discussion now look at this he is this is the king of pentacles and this is above your head but he is offering you the investment this could be the Aries or this could be the Virgo it could be uh, a new passion like I said because we've got the knight here of cups so something is being offered to you either materially 
all romantically and I think you are moving away from being alone because I feel there is more people around you you're either working together or you're coming together wow that's gorgeous then we have the knights and the knight is bringing you an offer and you are seeing it okay you are seeing straight to the future you are moving on you've taken that offer whether it is in work or whether it is in love again you've got usually it is a mother and a child and the person that uh, pushes the boat across the river but here this is you with to other people you are forming proper foundations within a crowd you might be a manager you might get or manageress you might be promoted to the next level you be you will be instructing people under you it doesn't have to be a teacher or an advisor it could also be a managerial or a position absolutely beautiful good luck with that uh, cancer because you do work hard and you are a nurturing type so you are the right person for the right job okay only if you believe that's what the angels say only if you believe can you fulfill this task and stand strong like the Emperor and the King of Pentacles they are men that know what they want they do uh, uh, do research before they make the investment so that they know they will have a return now if you are hooked up I've got the romance card and the answer of the angel and your romance card you can take this for general but also for your romance or your relationship finances and career financial issues are a factor in your love life right now perhaps like I said you might have moved and you've moved into a home you might if you're not hooked up then yes the financial situation will be harder for you because you've got to do everything on your own but I believe there's something coming in uh, perhaps a new partner and uh, that will lighten the load and I think you're going to get promoted so that could also lighten your load if it's not promotion you might get a rise because you've got recognition that you um, are awesome that you you want to spread your wings and you might have talked to your boss about it um, and they're going to go ahead because they think you're awesome at what you do and financial issues will be lightened okay um, and something will become clear to you definitely because you're moving away from difficult times to m much more peaceful and lucky times because you've got the six of swords all right you've got the Midas touch which is very important you know how to be a leader you're very you could be very spiritual okay there's the leader the king of cups the hermit uh, the emperor those are all leaders and you've got the new beginning because of the Phoenix the judgment card and the nine of uh, the big arcana the hermit so where there is endings there are new beginnings and the better ones than you have had for a long time I hope you've enjoyed this reading take care and enjoy your week please like and share ciao ciao Thank you.